Hello, Aries. Welcome to your shadow judgment. No, no, no. What am I talking about? No, this is your mid-November to December read. This current year. Yay. So we're just going to do it simple. It's going to be a six ways, of course, because... You know, I don't want to waste a lot of time today. Plus, I've been up since four because I was drinking. So now I got a day drink in order to make up for that. In order to get some sleep. Because I don't know. Anyway, Aries. This is for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Check your charts. If this resonates with you, good deal. If not, don't worry about it. Just boop your nose and away it goes, right? You end up wanting personal read. All the information is down below in the description box as well as the listing for all the music I use. But yeah, we're not using hometown radio anymore because that's where it seems like I get a lot of the problems with that weird computer bot thing that like copyrights people. Like, it took me, like, 12 hours to figure out what the fuck was going on, and it was just like, oh, okay, well, at least I understand now. But it's whatever. Anyway, but that's all f f par for the course, that is. But anyway, yeah. Um, newcomers as well, your first reading is on the house, so, uh, there you go. And I do take tips and donations. Thank you very kindly in advance. All right, Aries, what did you got? Uh, we got the Eight of Wands reverse. Some messages again delivered so action can be taken. Um, and that's because the situation has the Ace of Swords reverse. Someone is not revealing the truth about anything. You know, the wants and wishes, we got temperance. But what the obstacle is, is Libra's card, justice. The fears and rejections over here is the Page of Swords. Also Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. How this shit starts, how it'll end, uh, catalyst, as well as the final result in all of this. The Five of Cups reverse. A lot of abusiveness, I feel. Like, I always think that this reverse is like someone who won't let some petty bullshit go, and it gets to the point where they're just harassing another person over it. Like, and it's like, you know, when are you gonna get off my fucking back, lady? Like, I'm sorry you spilt your cups. They're just cups. You still have two. And and and, that, and then when you say that, it just sets her off. She's just like, what do you mean I have two? I'm not going to You know. Like, this shit's expensive. Got from Walmart. You know, like, just nagging about weird stuff. But it's getting to the point now where it's, it, and like, I almost feel like it could be physically abusive in a way. But it's like this person's also what's being rejected and feared, Aries. Also, a cross watcher switcher you need to. Yes, yes. Okay. Um... This person who I feel like is the, doing the nagging is also looking for reasons to nag, too. Then what we got for your beginning theme is the Knight of Cups. What are you doing all the way over there, Murphy? You crazy, crazy sir. Uh, Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio's card. Right? Someone running the complete other way. From whatever this nonsense is because it's like someone isn't getting any information about this justice here so they're going snooping for whatever they can and if they can't find anything they'll damn sure find something to use to make it look like it's like it's like a bitch who like goes out of her way to um damn it what am i trying to say it's like somebody who goes in the in like smear campaign like, a narcissist smear campaign. The narcissist says a certain things about a person, and then you realize, oh! This person just making everybody hate me just to feel better. Okay, that's fucked up, but whatever. You know. Like, that's kind of like, how this is coming off. It's, it's like a smear campaign, just spreading rumors or looking for something to spread. But this is an obstacle and challenge, and this is a fear and rejection, particularly dealing with this crazy lady. Um, some truth is being withheld in regards to this temperance right here. And I feel like the truth that's being withheld is by the, by nagging lady over here. Mother. Uh, mommy dearest. That's who she is. She is Joan Crawford? Was that her name? I can't remember. Like... I want to think that was her name, but I'm probably wrong, so please don't sue me, whoever's responsible for that. 
right brain. Anyway, let's go ahead and go through this, y'all, because I'm losing focus. Also, I'm day drinking. Don't tell anyone. Anyway, you probably could not hear that because I literally was whispering. <laughs> All right, so we got the Eight of Wands up here, right? Someone is um, in the energy of feeling like they're not getting something that they want. And I feel like it's this justice. So that way, they're justified in behaving this way, Aries. And I don't know what the fuck that... I have no idea what that's about. And I don't know if I like this, whoever this is. Because it's like this person um, wants a reason to be angry. You know. Yeah, they're willing to throw justice out the fucking door, too. Or they feel like justice has been thrown out. Possibly dealing with the Virgo or Libra. Let's see. Uh, but that's because they're all in their own little world, right? With the Two of Wands. And they want to keep choosing their world. Or they're living in a fantasy or some shit, right? Asa... Swords down here in this situation, the truth is being muffled for whatever reason. Held back by this person by their wreath on their head. There's to be like, no one's getting to touch this sword of truth. Only I touch it. I'm holding it back. It's mine. You know, they're willing to fight people over it too. Like they're they're just ready to be like, I'm on the defensive and I will fucking win with the seven of wands. You know? Uh, 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 what? Like, I wish a motherfucker would. You know, like, that's the... <laughs> it's like, that make the Eight of Wands. If a person were to come up, Aries, this could be you. I think they're expecting you to come up and get a serving of uh, an ass beating with the side dish to shut the fuck up. Or they're thinking that you're going to do this. And they're looking at you, possibly, like you're a page. Like, as soon as this dude steps up to me, the Eight of Wands will finally move. Which is what they're wanting. It's like, they're trying to agitate you in order to get something done. All right, Temperance, Sagittarius is card. What's up? People wanna be coming together uh, after everything burnt the fuck down, trying to find peace or some sort of something to relieve the soul. Maybe chicken noodle soup for the soul. That shit was really big back when I was in school, man. Like, if teachers read us anything, it was always those books. And it was just like, ah, oh, I'm so sick of hearing, like, what's good for the soul. <sighs> yeah, this person's wanting to come together. Like, actually be a pairing with somebody else. That's a want and wish. But everything was burning down while they were resting. And now it feels like this burden is far from over. Whoever this queerant is, Aries. The obstacle and challenge down here is the justice card, though. The person still... Ref this person... This asshole wants justice, but they don't recognize that they did shit to themselves. Is this the clearing from the other day? I'm, 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 I'm truly curious, but it doesn't... I like it because I do randos on a regular. And it's just like, sometimes people will pop up and I'm sitting here like, hmm... Like, this person wants justice, but I feel like they don't realize that, like, they're doing shit to themselves. Like, the eclipse here, it's supposed to, like, help expose the side of the dude. And look, this is his armor. Like, he's completely fucking nude. Or whatever. Right? This is his armor. So he's looking at it like, man, I, I did this all by myself. Nobody did this to me. And the eclipse helps shows that, right? But it's reversed. And it's like, even with the eclipse, like, this person just doesn't get it. And it's just like, ah, 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 ah. And it drives you nuts, you know? Ugh. Oh, okay. Just go on the floor. That's fine. That's fine. Okay, let's see. Uh, yeah, something from back in the day isn't working, or it didn't work. One of the two. Um, might have been somebody who was reliant, might have been going up to somebody who you looked up to. Um, maybe sometimes it made you feel like the just the goodest boy ever, you know? Um, but here's like, these people are coming up and be like, Dad, can you loan me $10? Can you loan me $10? You know. And that's because fate stepped in, so that's why that shit's not working anymore. Like they got cut off or something? Hmm. Hmm. 
Hmm. That blows, man. Like, for real, for real. Anyway. Sorry, I had to take a swig. Anyway. Page of Swords Reverse. Fears and rejections that someone's saying some shit around town trying to start a riot against you. In order is to have you condemned in judgment. Not uplifted, Aries and Crosswatcher alike. Um, but if that were to happen, you would still have the opportunity to come back from that. Like, they want you condemned, but they don't realize, like, you know, even if they defeat you, you'll still be able to get on your own feet and then take off from them where they can't reach you. That might be a fear or rejection for you or for this person. But I think you both realize that there's not much that this person could do against you, Aries. And cross watcher that would have like long standing repercussions. Like, if this was someone who's trying to punish you for some bullshit reason right here that isn't even significant and are going out of possibly their way to like just do nasty stuff, oh my god, like, fuck them. You know, they are quite, quite boring. Let's see. How it's. Oh, no, no, no. I still got one more right here. I'm just talking. Yeah, it, it, like they bit off more than they can chew. This is like Tyr getting in his hand chomped off by Fenrir, if you don't know the Norse mythology. Look it up. It's always good. But this person got more, bit off more than they can chew. And they still don't realize that they, like it's like their own fault, almost. They're still blind to that, you know. Like Something could have totally been successful, yes, but like they missed the goddamn boat. Like, there's the boat. It's in the distance. Bye bye Right? All right. I don't know how I forgot that one. That was my bad, y'all. All right. Five of Cups reverse. How this shit starts, how it'll end, how it'll come from circle, however you want to say it. This is a cycle, after all. Someone just on someone's ass. <clears throat> like, all of in your ass, zin ass, all of in your ass. Let's see. Um, a tower moment came between these two people, and someone now stands at a crossroads with it. That's a lot of Pisces energy, I think. I don't know what the tower is. Everyone, like, like I don't know. There are so many more associations in the Major Arcana that I don't recognize because I was just like, you know, I'm not, I, I should probably learn the history, but I'm too lazy to. But that would be good for video material right but it's like there's there's certain energies that are at play i know that the hanged man is a pisces card but i also believe that like the tower is two if i'm right but i'm probably not but we'll go with it right and it's like this is a total exposure of um if it's pisces you know pisces are the masters of illusion and of all sorts of other shit right um and it's like this got exposed on some level and now someone is just sitting there waiting for whatever Aries, you know. Someone is able to make their own fate. It could be you. Um, but the whole thing is, is like you don't want to put up a fight because once again, this is a relationship. Like, you know, you really like it. Like, you really like this person, but they all up in your ass. And it's just, that's the part that you don't... That's, that's the hard part, I feel like. That's the part that's, like, really getting to you. It's just like, you know, like, you be total great wife material or husband material if you just, uh, like, get off of me for one second. Stop being in my ear, almost. You know. Um, I mean, I, th I guess they got money to offer, but they're slow about shit. They take their time with shit. Hmm. What else? Okay, slowly but surely offer a divorce. This person will eventually, Aries, want to end the relationship. 
It's like they're it's almost like their behavior against you is almost to get you to leave so they don't feel guilty about the breakup, you know? Shit like that. That like that's how it feels. It's like they want you to break up with them so they don't have to deal with the stress and the issue of um breaking up with you. Like it's like they're a pussy. Like they don't want to do it, so they're just gonna be mean to you until you finally do it. You know, that kind of persona. What's the ending theme, please? Yeah, they're turning their back on you, Aries, and that is your card, even. Um, you feel like there's no control possibly with this other person or that could be you that's leaving this scenario. It's just like, I'm done. No more ass. I'm done. <laughs> oh, Lord. You guys. You guys. Anyway. I think you should just go ahead because I feel like this person isn't going to treat you any better than what they are, which is like a saying a lot, Aries. You know, you are definitely at a crossroads and you have people to help you along the way as you get ready to make a move towards your new start. Ow! Look at that shit, dude. Like this person doesn't care about like whatever, man, but you definitely need to care about yourself. With the situation, you know... Yeah, there's not going to be any happiness. This person's going to drag you through a fucking fire, dude. Like, all just to keep the truth under wraps. And I really feel like they want you to break up with them so they don't have to break up with you, dude. I, I, like, they're going to punish you just to avoid whatever truth there is. Unless there's something else going on here that I'm not picking up. But I feel like this person has, like... A, a lot, like, it's like something's gonna come out. I don't know what it is. Uh, but it, it's gonna make you realize, yeah, maybe I should just break up for this, from this person, because I really feel like they're trying to drive me insane. You know, like a cancer. A cancer, when they're mad at you, will try to make you crazy just to prove to everyone else that you're fucking crazy. You know? Now, they're also my polar opposite, so I understand the madness. Let's see. You know. With the wants and wishes over here. Someone had to choke that fucking lion out. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Not communicating. Mm. Wait a minute. Mmm. Aries, I don't know about your per about who this queer is, man. But it's like they would choke a motherfucker out just so they wouldn't have to actually just have a discussion with them. Which is like the actual fuck, man. The actual fuck. Let's see. Obstacle challenge. Oh, there you are. Just being like, you're gonna be my bitch, bitch. Mm. Yeah, they wanted you to. Uh, they. Oh my god, this person was so focused on making you look like an asshole, Aries and Crosswatcher, of course. Um, it's like they tried their damnedest. Mmm. Like they want justice for whatever reason against you or for you or whatever but they're doing shit to themselves thinking that they're gonna dethrone you and have like saint michael undo the dude and keep you out of heaven which is just like that's fucking ridiculous like whoever this person is needs a like a hug or a nap or something like their complete focus is just to mess with you and that's annoying it's like why don't you go do something with yourself like you fucking loser like th like that's how i feel you know i'm a capricorn so it's like i don't care I, re I really don't care. <laughs> okay, look, dude, right? This fear right here that someone's gonna overwhelm you, Aries and Cross and Cross Watchers alike, right? One of the two, right? Um, look it, that shit is just in no way is going to work. 
They're going to trip over their own shit. And then they're going to be sitting there like, well, I don't understand why that didn't work out the way it did. Like, uh, shit, I, I even, like, made sure I fed the horse today. You know, it's like they can't put things together to understand why all of their stuff flops around, right? Or it could be because this is the Knight of Wands, you know, like, you're not leaping into anything, and that's why it doesn't work in their favor either. Because Ares, like, this Knight of, of Wands, he is going for booty, but he's got tricks for that booty. But he tripped over the Sphinx and then, like, broke the horse's legs. So the horse had to be put down. But I don't know if you have to do that now. Like, there's got to be ways to save a horse and not worry about, like, you know, putting it down if you don't have to. You know, like, if you could say, well, I don't know, that's the desert and that's a long way. And I don't know if you could drag a horse. But, anyway. But, yeah. Um, damn. Arrogance, either, like, you don't go towards this, and that's why it doesn't work, or it's this person trying to perform all of these actions, and they flop up and, like, screw up their horse, and that's why it doesn't work for them. It's one of the two. But that's definitely the case here. Okay. Final kind of listen result full circle cycle. We got a book here. Someone definitely wants to go somewhere and puts their sword somewhere else. But they still don't want to end things proper, right? Because like they feel like they're bound by justice and all of that jazz, the laws, blah blah blah. You know. And they feel like they can't let go the way they want to, even though death's right there. It's just like, you know, we can go at any time, man. Like it's not important. Right? Uh, because, like, at this point, like, the door is going to be closed and people are going to be moving away, man. Someone's going to take some action and shoot a motherfucker. And they get caught for it. Mm, that's why you don't commit murder, I will say. That is why, because usually you get caught. Mmm. Aries, this person, whoever they are, I feel like mm. Mm -mm -mm. like if this is a narcissist, they're not really good at it, like to a fall or some shit. I don't know. It's like, oh my god, like. You think you would know better, but this person does it's it's like they're a person who doesn't realize that like they're making things worse just to make themselves feel better. And honestly, Aries, if you're dating this person, cross watcher too, uh, just go ahead and break up with them because honestly, it'll help you dodge a bullet in the long run. Okay, okay. I will see you guys later because this is the end of the reading, right? Right. Uh, love y'all's faces for any newcomers if you enjoyed this and you want to watch more like you can like share subscribe that's what you want to do no pressure of course but i'd greatly appreciate it right okay you guys have a good day and i'll see you later bye, -bye.